Here it is going now guys, Talk Nuri City here back for another video. I hope you guys are all doing fantastically well. The season is finished but that doesn't mean the end of the content. Today we are back for the best five Norwich kits ever. Now there's been some absolute stormers in the past so this is going to be tough to pick and I'm going to need your guys help as well. As well as this, at the end of the video you guys can be in with a shout of winning £100 worth of vouchers for classic football kits. I'll give you some more info on that at the end of the video. But without further ado, let's get into my top five ever Norwich City kits. In at number five then, I'm going for a bit of a different one. It's the 2011-2012 Aria kit. Now we were back in the Premier League, we were flying high, we were doing well. We had Grant Holt, Simeon Jackson, Russell Martin and Wesley Houlihan doing the kit launch. And the kit launch video was possibly the worst thing I've ever seen, but it was so bad it was good. It had this kind of Italian vibe. It had these kind of like strange black borders around the side to make it look all edgy. But the kit was actually really, really nice. It was classic. And I think the same thing with kits is they always go higher up in my ranks depending on how well we played with them. And that season we were absolutely fantastic. Grant Holt, the talismanic figure, wearing that lovely collar. The 2011-2012 Aria kit gets in my number five. So in at number four then, it's uh, a kit I own. It's under the table and it's this one. It's the remake of the 93 Egg and Crest kit. It's got this lovely kind of metallic logo and considering this is a third kit, it's actually sold very well. I saw loads and loads of people wearing it this season and it's just because it's really, really funky. It's like a hipster art student has just gone into Norwich and gone, look, we need to remake this and we're gonna do it. Once again, made by Aria, it's got the Norwich City um, football club thing here, Aria, it's got the Italian flag and also the English flag. We stand together. It's beautiful. It really is beautiful. It makes this camera go all funny because it's just so odd. But this one gets in at number four on my kit list. In at number three then, and this is the first kit on the list that was before I was even born. 15 years before I was born, in fact. And it gets on it because it's just a classic kit. It's the Norwich City kit from 1982, made by Adidas. I know, Adidas, as some people say, Adidas, but it's definitely Adidas. And there's not really too much to say about this kit. It's plain, it's got a few nice little stripes down, the Adidas logo and the Norwich City crest. And it's just a really beautiful bit of work. To be honest, no memories whatsoever from us playing in it because I wasn't even born, but it's just a beautiful kit. And I think it deserves a place at number three on my list. Number two then on my list of top five Norwich City kits ever is the 2014-2015 Norwich City kit. The kit itself is okay, like it's quite nice, um, but it's the memories that came from it. The promotion from the championship in the most incredible circumstances, beating Ipswich in the semi-finals, beating Middlesbrough easily in the final and playing in this kit, I think has got to be the best selling kit ever in terms of Norwich City. Uh, so many people bought it the first time it came out and then when it was kind of re-released with that Wembley kind of design with the print on the front, the Wembley kind of things, it was a really memorable kit and I didn't actually buy it. I don't own one of them kits. I, I don't think the YouTube money was rolling in like it is now um, back then. But look, it is a truly wonderful kit. Um, the nice kind of like green cut that goes into the yellow, look, Brilliant, brilliant memories from that kit and a really nice simple kit when there wasn't like the Aviva logo and kind of cut out in the middle. 2014-15 kit gets in at number two. Finally then, number one on the Norwich City top kit ever and I'm pretty sure you've all guessed what one it is. It's this one. It's the absolute beauty from 1993 and what a kit it is. Once again, a kit that I wasn't even born for when it was released, four years before I was born, but it's just a beautiful piece of art. I'm not even gonna call it a kit, I'm gonna call it a piece of art. It's got the Norwich and Peterborough sponsorship on, um, lovely bank, um, got my savings account with them. Um, nice little logo, got the Norwich kit um, logo on there, of course, it's a Norwich City kit, but it's just wonderful. It really is just the hipster's dream of a kit. Some people probably hate it, Others love it. I certainly love it. I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm a hipster, but I can appreciate art like this. You know, it's just random. It really is. It's, it's the Egg and Crest kit. It's a beauty. I love it so much. This is my number one kit. 
Let me know your top five down in the comment section below. So they were my top five ever Norwich City kits. And as I said at the start of this video, you guys can be in with a chance of winning £100 worth of vouchers for classic football kits. All you have to do is head over to the Ball Street channel. Links to that will be in the description as well as the video. You can click at the end of this if you want. Head over there to their top five ever kits and comment in their video with your favourite ever kit. Probably going to be a Norwich City one. Head over there, comment your kit, um, what your favourite kit ever is. Subscribe to the Ball Street channel and also like their video and you'll be in with a chance of winning £100 worth of classic football kits vouchers to get whatever kits you want. They've got tonnes of Norwich City kits on there. So you can be in with a chance of winning £100 worth of Norwich City football kits. If you're an opposition fan, then you can get whatever you want. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. Let me know your top five ever Norwich City kits and head over to that Ball Street video too. And I'll see you very soon. Peace out.